Good morning, Britain. President Trump threatens fire and fury like the world has never seen against North Korea, as it threatens a possible nuclear attack on the US territory of Guam. And the man accused of kidnapping British model Chloe Ayling says he did it to pay for cancer treatment as the questions mount over her version of events will speak exclusively to one of her friends. And he used to be in Blazing Squad, don't you know? Love Island's Marcel joins us with the rest of the gang as they reunite for a one-off show right here. Wednesday, 9th of August, 2017. Live from ITV Studios in London, this is Good Morning Britain with Jeremy Kyle and Kate Garraway. Hello again. So our main news this morning, North Korea says it is carefully examining plans to carry out missile strikes on the U.S. Pacific territory of Guam. The statement came just hours after President Trump warned Pyongyang that any threat to America would be met with fire and fury. In a moment, we'll speak to our chief correspondent, Richard Gaysford, at the Foreign Office. But first, we'll cross live to Harry Horton in Washington. Harry, uh, I've said it before this morning, uh, people waking up and hearing this will be concerned, escalation of tensions between the US and North Korea. What does it mean in reality? Well, there's lots of concern here in the United States as well. It's not clear whether those remarks...